Hello! Welcome back. Nightmare Mansion is done, at least as far as the map screen is concerned. I'm gonna have to do it again someday to see the right side of it. Uh, but today I want to go to Night Mansion. I believe this was the first... If not the first mansion that was included with the game ever, it was certainly the first one that I played during beta testing, and uh, the one that I feel like I've spent the most time playing, so... Even though I remembered almost nothing of Nightmare Mansion, uh, I should be a little more familiar with this one. But we'll see how, how well my memory actually holds up. I do wonder... Hmm. I'm curious what's down that pit, if there's actually something down there, but I'm not gonna try writing these platforms down. Sticking with hard mode, at least for now. I didn't feel like I had so much trouble with Nightmare Mansion that it uh, warranted switching to normal. I think I'll be able to handle this okay. Right, so let's see. I can either go down that pole or up this vine. Can't return from the pole, so I'm gonna go up the vine right now. I mean, I can return to the pole eventually, but not immediately. That bird is gonna... Hasn't caused me any problems yet. Okay, here we go. So here, I can do the thing I wanted to do in that other place that gave me so much trouble in Nightmare Mansion and actually wait for regenerating platforms to continue. If I move quick, can I beat the bird? Uh, kinda. That worked. I think... Hmm. Hmm. I have a suspicion. I'm gonna try something that might result in death. But I, I just have to try it. If I jump left from here... Okay. Nothing there. Now I know. So that's one life down. Got a red key that I'm not ready to use there. I'm gonna save it for a moment. Because I think that there's several ways to go in this first section of this mansion. Um... I want to see if I can get anything anything good with this red key if I don't spend it immediately. Blue key. Pull down. Pull from above. That's where the red door would lead. Okay, so red door leads there and on upward. Okay. Uh, this red bird is a problem. Okay, so I can't stay there. <laughs> Alright, so I did get a blue key, which lets me go in here. Let's do that now. I see a map over there. How would I... Where's my... <laughs> missing my M key. Uh, red door would lead me in there, so I think I think that's where I want to spend this red key before I go up there. This is the path to progressing beyond this first section, as I recall. So I'm going to stick around the first section a little longer and see if I can find some good stuff in it. That opens that. Other one, I'm pretty sure, opens the trapdoor with a scorpion. I can just deal with him, so just in case it does something else good. It's not a problem. See the ladder, but first... Aha! What's this do? Hmm, closes that but opens... I see. Oh, and I can't reverse it. Okay, well, that's closed now. Okay, other one probably opens the other door. That'll get me to a red key. Don't have blue. I thought that looked awfully dodgy. A lot of skeletons there. I should should have known there'd be a spider. Something's gonna open. Oh, this this will open it. I see. That's how you. That's what you feed the spider. I see. Oops. Should have paid more attention. Alright, four lives left. 
Let's try and make a few fewer mistakes. You don't go into lava, do you? No, not quite. I see that indentation in the wall. I think I can afford a little bit of exploratory jumping to see if there's anything there. There's not. Okay. Something here, though. I see the ladder. Not too happy about having to deal with this spider, though. There isn't even anything on the other side of it. Here we go. Shield! Alright, so where am I going to end up when I come back from here is what I'm wondering. Okay, good. I did want to pull this lever, but now what? Go back around, all the way back around, get the red key. Okay, great. And I'm back up to six lives, so I guess, yeah, right. I have enough points for that. Good. I've made up for my blunders. Hmm. Hmm. How do ceiling tiles like those work? Okay, I did get blocked at some point there. I think... Hmm. Still not 100% sure how all the wall collisions work. They're strange. I see. Alright, so that was a little safer. Just jumping there, I do run into a, a thingy. A solid wall. Ooh, that was close. I do have a shield to protect me, though. Ha! Ah. Yeah. Uh, still no blue key to get through there. There's one. I don't like the look of those birds up there. Yikes! Okay, so I can spend a blue key here to get another blue key and a shield. Good. Okay. I'm happy with that outcome. And this is why I'm not, uh, not spending my keys up in places like this just yet. Just take them down here and you can get some good stuff. I'm still amazed that I managed to only get 15 percent What's that above, uh, below me? That's weird. It's like a little bit of blue brick peeking through the, the dirt. I'm still surprised I managed to get only 15 percent of the secrets in Nightmare Mansion. I don't know if it's just like they're they're s distributed weirdly so they're all on the right side or if I actually played that poorly. I saw one when I was reviewing footage that I could have gotten and didn't. But it was just the one, so that wouldn't have gotten me much more percentage. Watch out! Ah. <laughs> well at least I took out two of the birds. Uh he did not finish pulling the lever. I see you. Oh, nice! There's enough for two more extra lives. Good. I made up for my blunders once more. All right, so this is this is turning out to be balanced and staying staying at equilibrium with six lives. Uh, I can go through there, but I want to see what's up here first. Right, this was the passage that I had to close off. Right, this will get me a red key. Pretty well stocked on red keys at this point. That ladder leads back up to a place I've been. Okay, no. <laughs> I, was, I was trying to see if there was a way to take an extra red key with me, but no, I have to go through this door to get out. Alright, so if that's my way out, then I should finish my business down here before I go this direction. Uh, okay, I got away with it. A lot easier with only two pairs of birds there. Wait, just a sec. I'm gonna have to go all the way around. <laughs> Fine. I'll do it. 
for your shield and your gold coins. How often does that zap? Not very often. These spiders are very unpredictable. I'm pretty sure they don't have a consistent pattern to them. Like how they... How they go down and up. Uh-oh. Oh, I oh, was afraid I wasn't going to make it. This... This is weird. Why am I going behind this stuff? I guess it's so my head will go behind when I'm below and jumping? Hmm. Some strange layering there. Map has shown me... Has it shown me anything at all? Hmm. Nah, that's not a secret wall. The map has shown me these two rooms. Yeah. Yeah. Yikes. That's a lot of birds. Okay, well, I'll be going back up there once I've finished my business down below. sure if I'm at a height where those can get me. I will assume they can and not jump where my head would hit them. Right, so once more before I go up above, I'm going back down below to get that shield, those two coins, and the extra blue key. Shouldn't take too long. Made it back around in one piece. So, next I go up Vine. And unlock that red door I skipped so long ago. Uh, is this the Vine I want? Hey, <laughs> keep fumbling around for my map key. This one is a little easier, so I might as well go there, because I already, already did that section. I really shouldn't make blind jumps like the one I tried to make over there if there's no indication of there being a secret off-screen. At the same time, though, I, I vaguely remember having found stuff hidden in places like that, so... It is awfully tempting. If, if, if something... If a platform of vine or something gets me really close to the edge of, a scre of the screen... Uh, sure, I can take that detour. Uh, then I'm gonna want to take it. Uh, uh, check it to see if there's anything there. Does that lead around? <laughs> I cannot find my map key to save my life for some reason. Yeah, that does not lead around. Gotta go this way. There's a pole there. Something is above. Oh, wait, no, no, no. That's just a pole to slide down here. Never mind. <laughs> there might be something above, but not necessarily. Hidden coins. Right, so if I did not have an extra red key, I wouldn't have been able to get in there. Ah, and that counts as a secret. Awesome. I'm glad I took all that time to do all that stuff. Because I'm pretty sure the net result of uh, going down below and doing all that, key-wise, was one extra red key. <laughs> I like how that spider got trapped down there. Okay, in this room with all the lovely birds. Uh, there's a save pedestal. Great. Oh, those two silver coins. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get them and go all the way back around.
Oh, this is nice. The trapdoor closes itself again, uh, so I don't have to deal with the spiders. I'm starting to wonder, well, a couple of things. So I'm looking at the lever handle colors. I think it's either that they're just uh, chosen at the, at, in the room editor and don't actually mean anything, or that, um, that they have to do with whether something resets when you leave the room or not. So I don't know. I'm, I'm doing a terrible job at really paying attention to them to seeing what color corresponds to what. They don't seem like they correspond to the type of thing the lever is connected to, so it's it's either just an artistic choice or has to do with whether it resets and you leave the room, I think. Uh, yes, I can duck out those. Uh, before I go down, what's to the right? New section. Right. That's, that's progress. This is save. The map showed me... Oh, no, no, no. It just showed me this room. No, I've already been down there. Gotcha. Save! This looks moderately suspicious, but not suspicious enough to hold a secret. Okay, next section. Got two shields, eight lives. I'm in great shape. I like the moving shadow. <laughs> that painting... For one, it's on a column. For another thing, it does not fit with the art style of anything else in this game. That's probably a famous painting that I don't... Oh, yeah, I see what it is. It's just indistinct. I don't know the name of it, but I recognize it, I think. Oh, uh, yeah, that's fine. What's this do? Aha! What's this do? Okay. None of those have been bad yet. That one's going to open the trapdoor. Or not. That one up there probably does. This room feels suspiciously empty. I feel like there's some trap in it somewhere. Well, I, I see these two, and I see that thing. One or both of those is going to turn on the zapper. I'm going to guess both of them. Let's test that right now. No, it's just an on-off sort of thing. Okay, well, that's pretty simple. Uh-oh. Oops. Okay, there was a trap in here, and I fell right into it. Sorry, Jack. I was thinking too hard about, now can I walk over those skull platforms with one gap in between them without falling down? I did not think of the larger consequences of doing that. I need that red key. Maybe. Uh, I will... Mm, hmm. I'm gonna peek to the left before I make any choices, if, if that... if I can do such a thing. That was not very helpful. Yeah, I remember this section of the level. This is like a very dense maze of rooms. That lever probably opens the door and releases the spiders. Might as well do it now. Because I want to do it at some point. The reason I'm going for all the money, no matter how hard to get, is just for, for completion's sake, because I'm, I'm considering it a part of a, the con completion of the mansion to get every piece of money that's presented to me. Just like I want to find all the secrets, I want to collect all the money. Okay, that seemed good. Hmm, 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 hmm. This is a red door I want to open before other red doors? Oh wait, I have a choice. Oh, this is a... Oh. Uh, okay. What does this imply? Is this just two paths to the same thing, one much harder than the other? Let's see, that goes in there. With all those... What opens this? What opens this? Okay. I'm gonna defer... Well, I don't even have a red key to spend on that yet. Okay, 
So that's what opens that. Which means I can get in there and do that to open that, probably. Um, those... Probably open... One of those probably opens that. The others turn on the zappers. Okay, so this... Hmm, this way... It's possible both of those are required. It looks like this way is much more hazardous and will eventually lead to the same rewards, but also a silver coin here. And I was just talking about getting his, uh, getting all the money that's presented to me. I mean, one, I can't actually do that here if it's a binary choice between these two. And two, I'm starting to wonder whether that silver coin is actually worth it. The zapper patterns don't look too bad. I'm going to take the long way around. So I'll get one extra silver coin. First I need to pick up a red key. Uh, I can do this right now. I guess actually, well, since I went all the way back through this, since I didn't have the key, going in there isn't actually much quicker or safer. Because I would have to retraverse this terrain with all its hazards. So yeah, yeah, bottom route is fine. This is inconvenient. Okay, I would have been able to make it there. Let's go now. Uh, do I want to... I'm going to peek in here. I don't think I can go any further. No, because there's that door in there, in the way. All right. Whoa, whoa. I saw you zapping, but you turned off as soon as I started. Okay. That's fine, then. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. That's a blue key. That's not red. So I still need to go track down a red key somewhere. Uh, nothing else I skipped that I know about. Three choices. I choose the one that doesn't require a key. That painting moved. I think I saw something in that area move. Yep, it's a painting. <laughs> That's an easy shield to get. It's positioned such that it looks like it's going to be hazardous, but it's not really. Ooh, backpack! Cool! Uh, oh. Did I want to do that? I didn't really think about spending that blue key. I'm gonna hope... Well, I know there are rewards through this door. I don't know about those doors. So, I'll take the known one. I may lose all of these shields right here. But this seems like a worthy place to spend them. And again, if I play well enough, I might lose none of them. Hey, look at that. Perfect. <laughs> this is set up this way to tempt me to go all the way up, but I'm not going to do it. In fact, I could have made it to here and stayed there. That would have been smarter. Oh, well. Okay, got one red key. If I... Oh, hang on. Okay, green and blue. Yeah, I think I'm going to choose to spend it here. To get in there, get a green and blue key, a couple of coins. So then I'll open one of these blue doors. Blue doors are less hazardous than the red one right here, so that's a, another benefit. On platform. Okay, great. I'll just wait. That was a bad idea. 
I knew it was a bad idea, but I did it anyway. I think I see what's going on here. This is going to close that door. This is going to close that door. The far one opens it. Okay. I can deal with that, I think. I hope. Looking good. Cool. This way is still more hazardous than the other one because shields don't work on zappers. So I would have, have a couple of free hits on other things if I had gone the other way. Made it in here. I've not seen a green door at all yet. But I'm sure that's going to be important. So I think I've managed to take the way with the most reward so far. I'm going to find out when I go through those three doors, just what's on the other side of them. <clears throat> Ooh, that hurt. I should not make falls like that. Oh! I really shouldn't make falls like that. <laughs> Pay attention. Alright, uh, I choose top door. It's harder to get to, so by that logic, maybe there's better stuff through it. Hmm. Three-way split. That looks like good stuff. One green key gets me that. Two green keys... gets me that lever, which maybe... Hmm. going on here? Well, that's very strange. Ah. wonder why that happened. That didn't seem like it should have happened. Right, what do you do? Oh, neat. Ah, great. I'm really wondering if all those things are there just to entice me into spending one green key when instead I could spend two and get better stuff. That's what it feels like to me. I'm going to just actually hang on to my green key for the moment. But I don't get an opportunity to look at what's up there without actually spending the two green keys it would take to get in. Understand. Those are moving platforms. That's why the spider was interacting with them weirdly. That lever's going to start them moving. Uh. It could also be that three, uh, two green keys are actually required, and this is a bonus if I have an extra third. So I'm still not ready to... Yeah, actually, hmm. I got a red key for my efforts there. I think that's actually what it is. I can make this fall safely. Oh. Alright, that's not so bad. Let's see if this way leads to one green key. Because if it does, then I think that's that's exactly what I'm seeing. Not yet. 
cool. Yep, one green key this way. Probably another one down there. Alright. Well, I'll wait until I have three before I spend any of them. Uh, those do not go so deep in the lava as to kill me. Good. Ooh, that hurt. But I survived. Hey, wait a minute. Uh, 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 do those stay active if I leave the room and come back? Yes. That lets me save a blue key. Yeah. Oops. What's I doing that for? Okay, so I don't have to... Oh, no, that's a pole. Never mind. Still have to use that to get out. You're permanently on. You don't go off long enough from... Well, there's a door there anyway. I know what this is going to do. Yep. I'm out of shields, so the next hit's going to kill me. here. How would I get that? Oh, oh, well, there's a ladder. Alright, what's that showing me? Anything at all? Nothing I haven't explored. Okay, so, oh wait, yeah, yeah, one room. Ah! Well, that's not entirely informative, but I think, yeah, I think this is the way forward. This is a bonus room. And I have two green keys. There's a red key. Uh oh. There's. Mm hmm. There must be another green key accessible to me someplace. Oh, I got another red key, so I can get that one. Okay, great. So I can actually get both of those. It's not a not a binary choice. All right. I gotcha. So I pretty much might as well go to that bonus room now. Because it'll get me a shield and that might me save me from, from death if I if I if I mess something up. Uh it was up there. Ah, that's kind of out of the way. I'm going this way first. Hoping early in the next section there's going to be a safe pedestal. It's about time for one. Uh, yeah, this way. So I could have actually saved time by opening this red door up this way first. Okay, now I know. Overall, this seems a little bit easier than Nightmare Mansion Hard. I'm, at least I'm certainly having less trouble with it. Okay, three green keys, one blue. Time to move on. <clears throat> oh, I made that fall again. <laughs> well, once... Oh, <laughs> I made that fall again. What's the matter with me? <laughs> Well, I'm at six lives, so 
Staying at equilibrium. <laughs> Have I been over here? Yeah. Okay, loot. And that counts as a secret. Great. Those are moving. Can get up now. Not sure what's the point of that left one if the right one goes all the way up and down. Save pedestal, please. Yay, save pedestal. All right. So that's some good progress. Uh, here's where I'm going to leave it for today. Uh, Night Mansion going quite well so far. See you guys next time for more of it.